Hello and welcome to another video with me Christian Rauchenwald. Now a while ago I made a review about something called CryptoTab, a browser that's built on Google Chromium, so an alternative to your regular Google Chrome browser that allows you to mine Bitcoin on your computer. And I mentioned during that review that it might not be worth it because there are other alternatives that actually result in higher mining hash rates for you, but there are still consistently people that sign up for CryptoTab and there are also still people that from time to time leave comments on the video saying CryptoTap is a scam because they somehow can't figure out how to get paid. That's why I decided to make this short video to first of all show you payment proof so that you actually can get paid from CryptoTap but also to show you a better alternative to CryptoTap. So you can use this video to make sure you get your money from CryptoTap and then maybe consider switching the software so you'll actually earn more in the end. Now regarding the CryptoTap payment proof, we're gonna take a quick look at my CryptoTap affiliate dashboard. So this is where you see all the earnings that I generated. You see that I only generated 50 cents roughly myself because I only tried the browser to figure out how it works. And on top of that, I made $12 something from the affiliate program, which is also the reason why CryptoTab is not my recommended software for Bitcoin mining because from every coin you earn, some of the earnings are kept from you to pay 10 level of affiliates above you. So if you were to magically earn 0.01 Bitcoin, you actually don't get 0.01 Bitcoin, but only parts of it because again, there are 10 affiliate levels that get parts of your earnings. Now it's great if you wanna use CryptoTap, you can use the link down in the description below and I will earn based on your mining results and some other nine people above me will earn as well, but it's obviously not in your best interest. When you're mining Bitcoin on your computer, you wanna make sure that you actually get the best results for you. Yes, it's great if you use a browser that also pays me for your results, but considering how competitive the market is and how hard it is to mine profitable considering electricity costs in first world countries, you want to use the right software. Personally, I'm using NiceHash for Bitcoin mining and I have an old Windows computer which we're also using for recordings and that Windows computer has a decent GPU, so it has a decent graphics card, in that case an NVIDIA GeForce GTX 1080 Ti, which back then the whole computer cost roughly $2,000, now the GPU still is around maybe a thousand or eight hundred dollars or something like that. I really have no idea. But the point is you're mining faster with your GPU and NiceHash also supports mining on your CPU. One of the core differences between NiceHash and CryptoTab is that CryptoTab just runs in your browser so it can only use the processes that are within the browser. Whereas NiceHash actually has dedicated miners and benchmarks them to see which mining software performs the best on your hardware. So overall it's a no-brainer if you're currently using CryptoTab to actually stop doing that and switch to NiceHash instead. Now NiceHash is a separate software so it runs separate from your browser which comes with another advantage because it means that you can actually switch from CryptoTab browser to Brave browser. Brave browser is also built on Chromium. It has an amazing ad blocker built in and just by surfing and here and there looking at some ads you'll actually earn a basic attention token which is another cryptocurrency. You won't make a lot of money for me it's roughly one or two dollars per month but the point is you have things separated. You have a browser that's really great at what it does and still pays you a little bit, talk about 10, maybe $20 per year. Plus you have a separate software for mining Bitcoin. One last benefit I wanna point out when it comes to NiceHash is that in the advanced settings, you can enter your cost per kilowatt hour for electricity and you will see how profitable the mining is. I don't see the exact number right now because the screen that I'm capturing is like on the other side of the room but it's somewhere around one to two euro of profit per day that my Windows computer currently generates after electricity costs. So while it's not a lot, that computer running 24 seven actually generates roughly 30 to 50 or 60 euro per month in profit. 
it wouldn't be possible with CryptoTab. Now to finish this part, if you want to set up NiceHash on your computer, there's also a link in the description and in the pinned comment down below. Make sure to read the installation instructions because it's very important that you follow the steps for your antivirus protection so NiceHash actually works on your computer. With that, let's continue with the CryptoTab payment proof, so the proof that you actually get paid by CryptoTab. And for that, we go back to the CryptoTab dashboard and here you can see my payment history as well. And you see that there's one transaction from the 11th of November about 0.0005717 Bitcoin that I requested and has been completed and another one that I just requested today. Now those 0.00 something 5717 Bitcoin were sent to my DeFi wallet. It's an application from crypto.com on my phone. So I'm gonna quickly go to the DeFi wallet and in there you can see, I'm gonna actually go back so you see that's the real screen. You can see here for Bitcoin that we have on the 14th of November, the credit of 0.0005717 Bitcoin. So you can see that the payout from CryptoTab actually made it onto my phone. So that's pretty much it. As you can see, CryptoTab definitely pays the money that you earn with it. As mentioned, it's not the best way to mine cryptocurrency. You should nice hash instead. But for those people that constantly post comments like CryptoTap is a scam, I didn't see my money, it's harsh. But the sad truth is those people are idiots and are maybe making mistakes when they copy their cryptocurrency or their Bitcoin wallet address. So they have a typo in there and the funds go to some other account or whatever else it is that they do wrong. But I'm 100% sure that every time a user complains that he didn't get paid from CryptoTab, either he's not patient enough because as you see the payouts take a couple of days or he or she copied the wrong wallet address or something similar to that and that's why the funds then magically disappear. But if you do your job right, so if you copy your actual Bitcoin wallet address, you will receive the funds from CryptoTab. There is no magic to it, it's not a scam, it's perfectly legit, but it's not worth it. That's the main point. If you wanna mine cryptocurrency on your computer, use NiceHash. And last but not least, so as a summary for all of you, to get started, you can check the description or the first pinned comment down below and you will find links to everything we've talked about. If you still wanna use CryptoTab for whatever reason, you can use that link as well. And I'm already gonna say thank you for the money that I'm gonna make from your mining efforts. If you wanna earn more, then you can use NiceHash instead. And again, pay attention to the website with the installation instructions and follow all the steps, don't skip anything and switch your browser to Brave Browser. So you have one app that mines Bitcoin with better results for you and you have a browser that pays you in basic attention tokens, which is another cryptocurrency or token for just using the browser and comes with a better ad blocker. And last but not least, if you're not sure which crypto wallet to use, you can check out the link below for crypto.com. It's really my recommendation when it comes to crypto solutions. So again, check out the links in the description or the first pinned comment down below. If you have any questions whatsoever, leave them in the comments down below. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button as always so you don't miss any future videos. And if you're just here to leave a comment like crypto tab is a scam or something like that, then don't bother because I'm not even gonna reply. I'm just gonna remove those stupid comments in the future because if you are not able to copy your right wallet address then nobody else can help you. Thanks for watching, see you in one of my other videos, till then, bye bye.